going up a game, second game to the first act, taunted again, and oh then 2 0 me. Uh, so now I've got no friends, as far as I'm concerned. I'm a nomad in this society. And I'm actually going to put insult to injury. I've been commentating since the tournament started, and I wanted to talk to some people. So I'm gonna go leave for you. it, go for it. Yeah, 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 that's totally fine. Yeah. So I've been sub, uh, hopefully you liked me talking. Maybe I left the stream or muted it, I don't know. Whatever. I've been here, um, and I'm gonna leave now. All right, it was good to see you, man. Good to see you. I need a friend. Who wants to be my friend? I don't need a friend. I can handle this. The Goofers Daybreak. Just, just me. I can solo commentate to set in my sleep. I imagine. I have no idea who's a Goofers. Oh. Cloud. Oh my God. Yes. Oh. <laughs> if anybody saw. The last time Zagoo was here and he went cloud, it blew my mind. His cloud is ferocious. I'm so excited to watch this. And Daybreak is just always the classic, one of my favorite players to watch. So Zagoo versus Daybreak, it's a fever dream for me. These are two very aggressive players who play two very aggressive characters and they play them very aggressively. So it's a blast to watch, a blast to talk about. It's almost hard to keep up with. It's like trying to solo commentate a double set. You gonna join me, bud? All right. Zagoo with the four Bam tags. Shout out to Bam. Not able to be here because she's got a little bit of a cough and she's very considerate. Rip. Didn't want to bring her sickness to the tournament and risk affecting anybody else. So, Bam, if you're in the chat, we appreciate you, but we do miss you. The real hero. That's right. I, w I hope some other people can uh, take a leaf out of her book. <laughs> Daybreak tried to read the tech in with the forward smash, but the forward smash had so little lag that he was able to still chase him down after he didn't do the rolling, so it's kind of like an option coverage thing. Wolf forward smash is way too fast to be able to option coverage. Nice, nice high recovery to get away from that forward tilt. You're not gonna punish the full hop dare either with the back air. No, it's uh, who did the full hop dare? Which one? Uh, Zagu did. Zagu did. Yeah, yeah. yeah his, his full hop down. So Cloud's down air is of course vulnerable on the sides, uh, as we all know and learned in the last game, but. Uh, it's still kind of hard to punish because you have to get around him and the hitbox is there for so long. Because Daybreak was in the position to do it, he just, I don't think he recognized it. Maybe he was. wasn't ready for it. Yeah. He possibly had already decided what option he wanted to go for. Um, Zagoo uses up B very interestingly. You see a lot of clouds up B out of shield. That's kind of a go to thing for him. Oh, but Lord. Zagoo will up B just anytime you're, you oh. are above him. That was, that was such so good. A nasty gimp. Yeah. I, I, Wolf Snare is one of the best snares that just run it off and give for people, but I feel like that one was particularly dirty. You don't see a lot of wolves actually do that. You only see like only like higher level player wolves. It's actually. a it's a weird risk to take because as as it's just like Ganondorf in Smash Four, his reverse up air. Mm -hmm. You put one of the best edge guarding tools on one of the characters who have, have one, one of the, the worst, worst recoveries, recoveries themselves. Yeah. yeah. But if you're if you have the advantage to do it, it's so good. Yeah, you know, if so you're, good. And Daybreak knew he was up a stock too. So what is at worst case scenario, he he just yeah, they trade. finally loses that one. Lots of up airs. Trade. Wow. Um, I don't know if back air could trade with uh, Cloud up smash or up smash up air. Yeah, that is interesting. I guess it would just depend on the positioning. Cloud's up air nerfed in a lot of ways on paper, but made better by just how generally difficult landing is in this game compared to Smash 4. Um, because if... What? You, oh, <laughs> interesting the way that that killed. Okay. I don't know about that DI maybe, but it used to, in Smash 4 you used to be able to spam air dodge, so it was a little easier to land. Mm. And so even though it kills later and it doesn't hit you on the ground, it is just in general harder to land, and Cloud's up air hitbox is still one of the best at keeping oh, you yeah. in the air. And Wolf not having one of the greatest... Uh, from getting down. Landing options. Yeah. His landing options are not fantastic, that's true. Like you can only like maybe like mix up with a Viraverse laser, but that just puts you in a bit worse advantage anyways. Yeah. You'll see you'll see sometimes Daybreak will actually stall his landing with an up B mm -hmm. and then you'll like do it put a hitbox underneath him because he thought he was gonna keep falling and then he'll hit you with up B. He's got a couple things, but compared to something like Cloud's own down air, he doesn't have nearly as many landing tools. I'm really, cl I'm really glad that uh, Zagu is going back to uh, Cloud, especially with the buffs. It's so exciting it. to see a Cloud. I love Zagu's Cloud with my whole heart. I love it in a much more R-rated way on Twitter. Ooh, man, that that <laughs> I thought that Daybreak was going to be ready for that air dodge in and maybe down smash it or something, but yeah, Zagu makes it back on stage. He's actually got the percent lead. Um, 
Don't All versions of Cross Slash do an insane amount of percent. I think normal Cross Slash does like 21, and Limit it's Cross so Slash does like 25 or 26. It's like really good in this game. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good. It's super good. And you can you can true combo into it with Forward Air in this yeah. game, because Forward Air has less landing lag. I don't know why they did that, but... Because it's awesome. <laughs> Oh, that dash attack the buffs. kills. The buffs. That was yeah. The dash attack is buffed and it dash should kill, buffs. but not with any sort of good DI. I think they're trading poor DI, just like Zagu had on that forward. Yeah, I don't know if he was game. ready for it. It's just so fast. Daybreak hasn't hit the ledge. Oh. He has not hit the is ground yet. Oh, that had Barely to be a perfectly a positioned. Oh yeah. Uh, up B in order to not get hit by the forward smash. You expect nothing less from Daybreak. But. Right. Of course. Yeah. Okay. I, that was definitely a shield poke, right? It might have been. He might have not been expecting the multi hit, so he could have tried to roll after he took one. Maybe. Yeah, that's There's gonna be cloud. One. Yeah. That's hard with cloud. You gotta get that perfect sweet spot in order to uh, not get hit by the forward tilt right there. I just found out recently that Wolf side taunt or just down taunt, whichever one it is. He uh, he says, "Are you scared?" Yeah. In in brawl, he said, "What's the matter? Scared?" Yeah. And I always thought that that's what he said in this game because you can't no, really hear it. It's very they quiet. It. But it's just, "Are you scared?" I learned that only just a few days ago, actually. And I love that taunt. The taunt where he's like, like, like in Japanese, it's twice as bad. Really? It's twice as bad. It's, it's so bad. It's weird because in Brawl, that taunt was like, yeah. so it was like some weird noise that made no it was, sense. It was kind of cool though. And they were like, okay, we got to fix that to be something that isn't just nonsense. Yeah, it's more natural. But then they gave him, <laughs> and it's, like, it's still <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, he's like a. But I love it. It's so he funny. Like, he belongs in the Cats movie or something. Oh God, we don't bring that up. <laughs> oh boy. Wow. What an up smash. Okay, it's a goop. Response, I got a two-stock of my own coming <laughs> at you. Battlefield, I'm surprised. I want to know what Daybreak banned, because Daybreak should know better than anybody yeah. that you don't want to fight against Cloud on Battlefield or Yoshi's. He, Daybreak was... He was a Cloud in He Smash was a Cloud main in Smash 4. He was one of the best players in Michigan with Cloud. Yeah. And he would take anybody who would allow him to to Battlefield. So that's a surprising non-ban. It, it was good on uh, Zegu for recognizing... Uh, Daybreak was just pressing buttons. Like he landed with, or he just did a nair at a disadvantage, and he just caught it with an up smash on the platform. Yeah. What's insane is that Cloud's platform pressure when he's underneath you is already one of the best. He, as a character, has been considered kind of middle ground, somewhat mediocre since the game came out, but he still had incredible platform pressure oh, on, yeah. on on triplats. And so good they, at shark. And then they buffed up smash, its startup and its end lag. Whoa. Whoa. I'm not sure Whoa. what happened. I was I was looking at you. But now he's got that to pressure platforms with. Makes him even scarier. Um, Did he get hit with a back air at like 40 or 50 and just died? That's bizarre. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm not sure what would have happened. I mean, you could say it's Town's Blast Zones, but still, I don't think it would kill. Daybreak only taking 7%. There's an example I tell you. He just uses it to punish jumps. Yeah, he's uh, one of the many, or one of uh, I knew the only yeah. clouds. He uses up yet a shield uh, in a very smart way. Yeah, what, not just when you hit their shield. Yeah. Very luckily to get his jump back, but still up smash. He's alive. Oh, back air gets gonna back air. All right, Daybreak only oh taking fifty percent. Zagu, if he were to win this game, it would be a mir would be miraculous awesome. comeback. <laughs> yeah. Especially against someone like Daybreak. Good up air to get back on the stage. I feel like if he dashed up and got it. That would have been a good read, but just doing it in place, like, you have so much drift anyways. Yeah. Ooh, doesn't get the forward air, air back air, but Zagu was holding out and down, which is how what you should do. It's hard for people to remember to do that while they're already at the ledge, especially as somebody with a linear recovery as Cloud. But Zagu knows his stuff, so. That was a bad cross slash, though. It kind of was. I think it's kind of a kind of a Hail Mary. Please, will you just lose this first stock? Ooh. Oh, just barely misses that. the correct that. option, but he just mistimed it by a frame or two. That's Perry on oh, the Tomahawk. Oh, Daybreak's tomahawking this guy ever know. Ooh, that was actually a really yeah, good up there. Yeah, they tried to e-serpent him. <laughs> that was so yeah. good. <laughs> Another tomahawk back throw? No, up there. Okay. He doesn't want to stale back throw, I don't think, because now back throw might kill if he's at the edge, especially with rage. Well, like, you want Cloud off stage. Oh, 100%. But back throw will straight up kill if you don't stale it. Speaking Not of now that he has no rage. There's a back air that'll kill. Zagu is still on his last stock at 130%. Oh, oh no! What? Uh, <laughs> well, wha shucks. Wha you don't like that. <laughs> Oops. He